11 Secrets from Women Who've Lost Over 70 Pounds If there's a will, there's a way, that is true for everything including weight loss. Taking the first step is usually the hardest but it is achievable. People who have lost a whole lot of weight say that it takes persistence and determination to get to the body you envision. Once you start, you just need to keep going. It may take time, but it's all worth it in the end. According to those who have lost large amounts of weight, here are 11 steps they followed to promote the steady and healthy shedding of pounds. 1. Good Sleep Patterns Not many people understand the relationship between rest and weight loss. Many people believe that staying up actually helps you shed pounds. That could be true, but it is very unhealthy. When you are wanting to lose weight the healthy way, getting enough rest for your body to recover is essential. Sleep also works like nutrition for the brain. When we don't get enough sleep, we look for that nutrition elsewhere and research shows we usually find it in food. Make sure you have a good night's sleep every night to satisfy the needs of your brain. 2. Follow a meal plan. Don't waste your workout sessions on unhealthy eating habits. Find out what food you need to be eating to promote weight loss. Snack if you must, but choose what you eat. Enjoy what you eat by researching yummy but healthy recipes that are simple enough for you to try at home. Make time for treat days as well. If you know you're going out on Friday night, then make room for some pizza or a cocktail with your friends. Be flexible but in moderation. 3. Water, water, water. Sometimes we think we're hungry when we're actually really thirsty. Truth is, you can't have too much water. It is so good for the body. It promotes weight loss by stimulating digestion and ridding the body of the toxins it has. One tip, try shifting from cold water to lukewarm or even warm water. Especially after a workout, you will notice your sweat build up even more. Warm water is even better at promoting good digestion. Four. Have fun with your workouts. You need to have fun with what you do. If you enjoy individual workout sessions then go for that. There are also tons of group activities you can try out. Dance, do yoga, high intensity training or even Zumba, there is so much you can try out. Change it up from time to time as well so you're constantly learning and being challenged. Be a kid and enjoy what you do. 5. Positivity is key. Don't stress yourself over what you haven't accomplished, instead, celebrate what you have. Every single pound you lose is worth a cheer. Remember progress is a process. Take it a day at a time and, as stated, enjoy the little milestones in your journey to health. Sometimes, there are plateau moments in weight loss. You end up feeling like what you're doing is no longer working. At times like this, Try to change up your diet and workout routine. As long as you keep moving forward, you're doing great. 6. Progress Pictures This really works. Seeing your before and after photos brings inspiration to you and helps keep you moving forward. You might want to start it weekly. The first few weeks should have big results. Then, you can move on to monthly. Remember. The number you see on the scale is not the only way to see the progress you're making. When you feel a bit low, the pictures you take should bring you back up. Remind yourself of how far you've come on a regular basis. 7. Food Diary Be detailed. There are apps designed to help you keep track of what you've eaten and what your activity has been for the day. You can also write it on a journal if that works better for you. A food diary helps you to learn more about yourself as well, what diet works best for you and what trends show you will probably start gaining. It makes you responsible for your own weight loss. 8. Munch away. People often think of munching as an unhealthy eating habit, but that isn't always the case. There are just times when we feel hungry in between meals and we can't do anything about it. Staying hungry isn't healthy at all. To solve the situation, we munch on something healthy. This is part of being responsible for your own weight loss. Choose your snacks. Make sure they are healthy and contribute wisely to your daily calorie intake. 
you can have a small bowl of fruits or even vegetable slices. There are so many healthy options to choose from so there's no excuse to open a bag of chips. 9. Be ready. As stated, there will be hunger pangs to haunt your situations when you feel oh so thirsty you want a soda. Be ready for these moments. Have snacks available that won't ruin your diet and water as well. Train yourself to be satisfied with the healthy options available to you. It's all in your hands. Remember, persistence pays. 10. Be responsible. When we make dietary or lifestyle mistakes, we often blame it on the circumstance, we're too busy to exercise, too tired to cook or too afraid to try. Nope. That won't solve anything. Take responsibility for your actions. If you want to lose the weight, you need to be strong-willed and ready to do what you need to do. No one else can do it for you. 11. Run the race. The choice to have a healthier life is not short-term. Many times, we look for quick fixes and fall into the trap of crash diets and unhealthy exercise plans. If you want to live a healthier life, you will carry that lifestyle on for the rest of your life. When you lose the weight you need to, you can't revert back to your old habits. Embrace the new you and the changes you made to get there. Thank you for watching this video. If you feel valuable and meaningful to you, don't forget to give me a like and share button so that others will receive the same value as you. Please comment down below if you have any questions. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Make sure you press the subscribe button below and click on the notification tone to get the earliest notification every time I release a video.